What is going on guys? Be me at 27 here and welcome back to another video. Time to get your uh, no scopes, quick scopes and 420 day scopes because we are playing MW2 Rust and we're also doing a rainbow perk challenge simply because like it has like every perk besides I don't actually I don't think it has Vulturade. But yeah, so the rainbow perk challenge basically you have to get all the perks in the order of the rainbow so it starts with widow's wine then juggernog double tap stamina up speed cola uh mule kick um who's who because there's who's who in this map who's who then quick revive then phd and then Dead Shot is just at the end. Oh no, wait. Uh, Electric Cherry is after. Yeah, Electric Cherry is after Quick Revive. And then it's PhD. And then at the very end is Dead Shot. Because it's black. With like black and white. So, whatever. So, we're, basically, we'll just go along as we go. First, some people. Well, some people put Widow's Wine at the end. But I'm gonna put it, I'm gonna put Widow's Wine at the beginning because it's like darker red than Jug. I don't know. It's mostly black and then I think it's a darker red than Jug. So, I don't know. Yeah, we're just gonna do Widow's Wine first. What? What is going on, guys? BB at 27 here. And welcome back to another video. Today, it's time to get your no scopes, quick scopes, and 420 dank scopes. Because we're playing MW2 Rust Zombies. And we're also doing the Rainbow Perk Challenge. So yeah, it's going to be pretty interesting. There's so many perks on this map. There's like, like they're so easy to get. There's no power. I don't think there's any doors you have to open. It's PhD up there. Um... But yeah, so we're going to be doing the Rainbow Perk Challenge, which is basically you get, have to get all the perks on the map in rainbow order. So the first few I'm going to list off, or we'll go along as we go, is Widow's Wine, Juggernaut, Double Tap, Salmon Up, Speed Cola, and Mule Kick. Then after that, I think it's Who's Who, Quick Revive, Electric Cherry, PhD, and then Deadshot. Deadshot's over there. So yeah, it's going to be pretty interesting. Right, for right now, we're just gonna, I'm just gonna get set up with a, a few good weapons at least, and then we'll save up for, uh, Widow's Wine, which is only 3,000, I think it's 4,000 in Black Ops 3, but I think it, I think Widow's Wine in this map is lacking a few features, like all, all Widow's Wine is, is like the sticky grenades, the like, uh, pop out when you get hit by a zombie, but like it doesn't have like the advanced knife So I think they took off some of the price And we got a nuke, okay, let's see boxes right here. So we're gonna see what we get Hopefully freaking intervention. That'd be sick. I was playing this map yesterday Just to get kind of warmed up and get a feel for it so that I could actually be able to do the rainbow perk challenge and I did get one sniper. I think there's two different snipers in the box, and I didn't get one of them. So it was kind of lame, but, you know, whatever. So right now, we're just going to do headshots with the foul. Let's go ahead and hit the box again. And we'll get our first perk. Oh, we got a sniper. Sat. Wait. Dude, I just got a triple. <laughs> I got a triple collat. Dang. This thing has... This thing scopes in so fast, dude. And it has no idle sway, too. Ah. Uh, that dude dropped off. I like... The, I automatically like the sniper. Wish I would have got an intervention. Because that's just, like, classic interventions only. 1v1 quick scope on Rust. That's just, like, the classic... 1v1 style. So yeah, we got a mini Uzi too, which is pretty nice. So yeah, let's just let's just save up to buy uh, Widow's Wine now. 
and then we can go ahead and get Jug, and we can start running like an actual train and stuff. Okay, I'm gonna not knife. Like, I'm not gonna knife in this situation where there's like a ton of zombies. Oh, nice, we got double points too. Nice, dude. Okay. Insta kills over. We can we can buy Widow's wine now. Okay, Uzi is gonna be a really good point gun, especially later on. So I'm not gonna pack a punch Uzi. Well especially not gonna pack a punch it because then I'll waste a bunch of points I could be using to get, um, I'd be wasting a bunch of points I could be using to get, uh, perks. So, yeah, not gonna pack a punch. Also, what makes me really happy is that there's no perk limit. So, you, you can actually do the rainbow perk challenge without having to, like, um, do, like, an easter egg or something. Like, buy something to be able to have more perk slots. Okay. Man, this double points really helps, dude. Ah, uh, I ran out right, bef right before I start shooting into the main horde. It gives, and double points ends. Perfect. Okay. Um... This map is really easy to train on too, so I don't think we should have any problem getting this challenge done. Okay, is that last? No. I'm gonna save last zombie. Let's go ahead and get us some jug. And then we can also, let's see, yeah, double tap is next too, and that killed the zombie. Great. Where is double tap? I can't remember. There's quick revive up there. Where are you, double tap? I legit don't know where double tap is. I've probably passed by it so many times, but whatever. Okay, I can't fall from this high or else I'll die. Oh! Oh no, don't kill me, Widow's Lion, save me! Oh! There's probably gonna be zombies around here. Nope! Okay, that was kind of, that was a little sketchy, if you ask me. Okay, I need to find Double Tap. Where the heck are you, dude? Ugh. Watch as this map is just trolling me, and Double Tap isn't even on here. Dang, dude, so many drops. Past. Oh, that was that was nice. Dodge the nuke. Oh, there it is. Hey, dude.